On the sand-covered terrain of Dolo in southern Somalia, women and children mill about. They are among the 1.5 million people who have left their homes in search of assistance in this town. The spotty growth is a result of the scant recent precipitation. Millions of Somalis have been compelled to flee their homes as a result of East Africa's worst drought in 40 years. The troubled nation has been brought dangerously close to starvation by five unsuccessful rainy seasons in a row, and this year is not set to be much different. Residents mention how their children died from malnutrition while discussing their struggles. Due to a significant amount of humanitarian relief, Somalia was able to issue an official famine declaration last year. Nonetheless, this did not completely stop deaths. Researchers discovered that 43,000 extra deaths in Somalia in 2022 were related to the drought there, even without the famine declaration. Half of these deaths were in children under the age of 5. Given the tightening of donor budgets, humanitarian organizations like the WFB were likely to receive less funding overall this year. Will the challenges that Somalis must overcome be similar? Forecasts from the Intergovernmental Authority on Development indicate that there is a 50% chance that this season's rainfall will be below average in terms of dollars. According to figures from the World Bank, maize prices have increased by nearly 23% over the past year. To assist 7.6 million Somalis in 2023, the UN has made a $2.6 billion appeal. However, only $609 million has been raised to date. Aid budgets are likely to be affected by the global economic downturn, the pandemic's lasting impacts, and a variety of international events, notably the war in Russia and Ukraine.